Alright, so hi guys, it's Casey here and welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, don't forget to click the subscribe button down below and a little bell to get you notified every time I upload. So for this week's video, it'll be a product review. So I'm gonna be reviewing the Clinique's Happy Heart Women's Perfume and I got them in two different versions. Not versions, but I mean sizes. So I got this perfume from Clinique, specifically in the branch that they have in downtown Montreal in La Bay. So I got this 50ml size. It was during Christmas last year on my wish list, and I recently just got this 100ml from the store that I mentioned. So right away, I'm gonna tell you about the price. This one cost around $70, and this one cost around $80. Yes, there's like 50 ml difference for $10, so I would suggest to always get the big one. I'll put the exact prices down below or definitely a link if you want to check them out by yourself. I've been using this perfume for two years now. Ever since I got here, my mom gifted this perfume to me and I definitely fell in love with it. I never got tired of it. And I hope the construction stops. So right on spot, I want to tell you guys about the packaging. So they come in this like pink gradient box. And the box is really simple. It just says the title in front, how many ml is it. And then at the side, no label. At the back, there's like a small palm. And also caution, ingredients, and any other information concerning the company. And when you actually open it, okay, whoopsie. I'm just gonna open both of them so that you can see the difference in size. Ta-da! So as you can see, this one is... Is there something like It's definitely empty. That's the reason why I got the new one. And look at the difference. The actual product is like a see-through thing because it's glass, of course. And the cap is not a magnetic one like the Chanel perfume that I've reviewed before. It's definitely you have to press it, this and that. It's definitely plastic and this one is glass, but it doesn't feel like plastic because of this metallic design. And as you can see, the small version looks exactly the same as the big one. But for me, to be honest, I would definitely recommend for you guys to get the bigger version because in a $10 difference, it's like 50 ml difference. And since I got this one from Christmas last year, you would think, oh, it's just 50 ml, it lasted long. It lasted long because I'm shuffling this perfume into the other perfumes that I use, which I will definitely make another video about it. But now that it's definitely empty, this time I really wanted to get a big one. And if you're in Montreal area, I don't know if there's anywhere else, if there's like any other clinic store other than the La Bay in downtown because they don't have this always in stock and luckily when we got there just this weekend we got it finally and this is the last one in stock so i know some people are definitely not interested about the packaging or anything they definitely want to get straight on the scent on what the scent feels like for me or something but it feels like for example me I also kind of love collecting different fragrances or perfumes so i always like to look at the packaging the box how does it look like for example if i want to display it on my shelf it matters to me i received a comment from my past like perfume review before that they don't really care about the looks of the box but well, at least i do so i don't know if, what do you guys think because me as i try to use and collect different perfumes i always love to preserve the boxes and also like the bottles and i don't want to be rambling about that let's go on to the scent which probably most of you and i understand most of you would really like to hear about the scent so for the scent, because it's perfume, perfume is more concentrated compared to cologne. Whenever I use this, it's definitely concentrated. So the very first time I use it, I really liked it right away. And I looked up into its fragrance notes, which I'll put it somewhere here in the screen. Definitely it has the scent of mandarin orange and carrots or something. You'd be like, ugh, veggies, why? But it's a nice flowery, powdery floral scent. It's Every time I wear this perfume, I feel so fresh because this, the scent itself feels like or smells like fresh. 
It's like something a baby would wear. The reason why I like it because it lasts well throughout the day. Like it would last six to seven hours all throughout the day and it would kind of fade nicely to your body like as if it's your natural scent. To achieve the six to seven hours of that it lasts on me is I usually spray it three times like on the hair and the side of the neck and the body and that way I would still smell it all throughout the day like after six hours seven would be the max but uh, to be honest sometimes it only lasts for five hours if I like spray it once or something one thing I like spraying it once is sometimes I just want to have like the subtle freshness subtle scent like it like it's not noticeable that you're wearing perfume but you kind of smell good kind of thing I don't know if that makes sense but sometimes I used to have my classmates well whenever I do that like I don't spray a ton of perfume on me but then I would spray once and then my classmates would ask me what is this scent on you? I'm like are you asking about the perfume? they were like no it's kind of a natural scent on you like it's actually perfume wait really? because it's fades nicely. So the smell of this is actually really fruity but not in a fruity too sweet kind of fragrance. I have tried different fragrances before where they smell like they smell like flowery and sweet but in the end the sweetness is too much. But this one seems like it's flowery, it's fruity in a subtle way and a very natural way that's why I really really love it. And luckily when I got the 100ml version, they were having like a promotional goodie bags at that time and the lady gave us two because I was with my mom. She gave one to me and she gave one to my mom. And like, well, of course, why not take the other one? If they allow it, of course. And she was like, yeah, go on, take it. I'm absolutely not sure if the, these products in here are very new. That's why they're trying to promote it or like products that they want to be known more so I think me and my mom will negotiate if I don't want some stuff and she don't want some stuff in her bag so we'll see so it came on this plastic thing oh I actually found a receipt a receipt okay so now the 100 ml is 86 86 dollars is that with taxes already? No. So $86 without taxes and after taxes it's $98. For me it's really worth it. It's kind of like an Ipsy unboxing or unbagging and I kind of like it. I actually did subscribe to Ipsy before but then I had issues like my products or my bag were not arriving on my place and they said it was returned to the sender and then we tried again and had another issue and I don't want to go through that again but I'm kind of interested in having like uh, ipsy bags or something we'll see in the future online is do I recommend the clinic happy heart women's perfume I definitely recommend every time I wear this product someone would definitely ask what perfume you're wearing or you smell nice today because it's definitely like a natural fresh scent and that's why I love about it but for me I'm the person that is into flowery scent and I don't mind fruity scent as long as it doesn't smell too sweet so that's it for this video guys I really hope that you like it Leave some feedback down below and don't forget to like, subscribe and leave a comment. Thank you so much for watching and God bless you!